how can you make money online? If you Google it, there's probably millions of websites and articles had talked about it. Unfortunately, too many of them are just sales pitches to convince you to sign up for some seminar, webinar, training session, or some other way to become an online millionaire. They really give online money making a bad name. It is possible to make money online, but the real legitimate ways to make money are not get rich quick schemes. I'm going to tell you a few kinds of legitimate ways to make money online. But remember, many of these options are real jobs that require you to put in hours if you want to get paid. They also require real work and sometimes a lot of dedication before seeing a return on your time. Number one websites that pay. There are all kinds of websites that will pay you for various things, such as shopping, taking surveys, or testing products. No, these websites won't make you a millionaire, but they are great for earning some extra cash. Here are some examples. Swagbucks. You can make money from taking surveys to using their search engine. You may also check out Global Test Market, ePoll Surveys, and Survey Club if you want to get paid to take surveys. Fiverr. It is a great place to make a few bucks. You can offer your services however you choose for $5 per gig. If you sell art and you're fine selling pieces for $5 each, that's a gig. Isia. It works in addition to a blog or on its own. You get paid to blog, tweet, take photos, and take videos. The pay is mostly based on your following. So if you want to make money with your tweets, you'll need to grow your Twitter following. Number two. Freelance writing. Freelance writing is one of the most popular ways to earn money online. Many successful freelancers can earn an average of 50 cents to a dollar per word. Some are earning twice that, but before that, you've got to build your portfolio and your resume and etc. It takes dedication and time, though it can be highly profitable if it's what you love. Before you decide to start reaching out to all of those freelance writing companies, you need to have a web presence or you could just have an online portfolio. Even a LinkedIn profile works to get started. Number three, sell your stuff. Ever since the idea of online auctions came into existence, the online selling market has been on the rise. Today, with the platforms like Amazon, Craigslist, eBay, Facebook, whether you're selling what you already have or selling like a store, there are all kinds of ways to make money by doing so. The following tips will help you do well in online sales. Get a PayPal account. It's the standard in online business for receiving payment and paying others. Take good pictures. Make sure you take a clear picture that makes your product stand out from the others. Be honest. If you're selling used items, be honest about every dent, scratch, and blemish. This will reduce many issues you could run into and keep your reviews positive. Do good business. Plain and simple, whether you're selling on a small site or opening an online store, your customer service matters. You want to get those positive reviews and make a good name for yourself. Respond to questions, concerns, and complaints. Offer a guarantee if available. Number four, blogging. Blogging is something that requires patience, persistence, and discipline. It may mean writing every day for over a year before you really start to see any money from it. Some people argue that you can make money without a lot of traffic. And while that is true in some circumstances, you will generally need a lot of website traffic to start earning from a blog, and that takes a while. Once you've reached that point, there are multiple ways to monetize your blog via advertising, affiliates, memberships, sponsors, subscription, and etc. Number five, work at home companies. Finally, if you're interested in working for someone else, while still making your own schedule and deciding where to work from, a few companies that will let you do just that, e.g. Crowdsource, Demand Studios, Fast Chart, Leap Force, Speak Right. Since we are talking about legitimate jobs, you've got to be legitimate. You want to make money online, but that doesn't mean it's not a real job. So, take it seriously. You aren't the only one in the business. In fact, the competition online is likely higher than it is in your local area. Be professional. Since you can't present yourself in person, your online profile has to be your most presentable outfit. Know how to use it without looking incompetent. Write in complete sentences with proper grammar. 
give some, but not all. Whether you're providing writing samples, a photography portfolio, or links to your work, give them enough examples to get the idea, but not so many that they don't even know where to start. And while we're on the topic, give them some of your background information, but don't tell them your life story. Double check yourself. Make sure everything you post online is good to go. And for God's sake, use spell check. This is especially important when it comes to the company's name. Now you've got many different options to start earning online. If you saw something that really interests you, try it out and learn more about it. If you're really wanting to make a full-time income online, you need to be dedicated to learning how to do what you want to do.